Hello friends. Today we are going to discuss about general studies and engineering aptitude paper in ESE. Now first of all let us analyze the percentage of marks of this paper as a whole from 1300 marks. So from total if you see it is of 200 marks. So its percentage is around 15%. Now let's analyze the topper marks in 2017 for each branches and how much they scored in general studies. So for mechanical topper marks was 837 and his marks in general studies was 129.34. So the percentage of general studies marks from total mark was around 15%. Similarly topper marks for civil was 831 and general studies marks was 106.66. So percentage of general studies marks from total is 12.75%. And similarly for electrical topper marks was 916 and general studies marks was 97.34. So percentage of general studies from total marks obtained was 10.5% and for electronics and telecommunication topper marks was 796 and general studies marks was 98.66 so percentage of general studies from total marks obtained is 12% what is the point of doing above analysis the whole point is the effort for general studies should not be more than 15% your rank and selection will mostly depend on technical part point is we can't miss this paper but we can be strategic now if you see e stopper almost everyone scored in this paper was around 50% now let's revisit our 80 20 rule which states that 80% of the question will come from 20% of the syllabus but let's take a conservative side and let's add 10% in that so 70% of the questions will come from 30% of the syllabus so we just have to concentrate on this 30% syllabus so conservatively at least we will fall near 50% Now to get the 30% of the syllabus let's analyze last two year paper now if you see the syllabus of this subject it will cover these 10 topics now let's see the marks distribution from 2017 and 2018 paper from these 10 topics now if you are preparing for gate you should easily attempt these two sections which are maths and aptitude secondly if you concentrate on material science and environmental it will cover more than 32% So in total 47% we have covered. Now to be conservative we should take another two important subjects which will be design drawing and safety and standards and quality procedures which in total will cover 71% syllabus. Okay if you see topic wise we are saying six topics out of 10 but if you see topic length wise most lengthy topic will be current affairs and maths and aptitude you might have already prepare for gate so if you see you have to study additionally for environmental material science design and drawings and standard and quality practices rest even if you leave you can still score the decent marks because questions level for ese is not that high as gate level so even if you have gone through to these topics once and twice and prepare good notes you can easily score now the last point is where to prepare for these topics As I said earlier you should only put 15% effort from your total effort of ESE preparation so best way is to find small lectures in YouTube or an academy about these topics and take only mock test don't purchase any book for these topics because you won't be able to finish them and it will eat up your time please understand you don't require deep knowledge on these topics they are just to check your knowledge on general engineering from other branches for mock test you can prefer any of these practice book from made easy or ies master both are equally good next you can follow pavan saini in an academy he has covered all the important topics like material science project management standard and quality practices and even some part of environmental ict and ethics you can also follow kartik bharadwaj for basics of energy and environment for design drawings and importance of safety you can follow aks azad mechanical engineers in an academy their courses link will be given in description these videos are very small 10 to 15 minutes focus only on ese you can just go through these videos and make good notes and revise only through these notes that should be sufficient now that's it for now guys hope this video was helpful and solved many of your problems if you liked it please give us a thumbs up and please share it with others so that they can also get benefited If you have not subscribed our channel click here to subscribe and please click on bell icon so that you never miss our latest update our engineering video usually comes on every monday finally thanks for watching